I knew that I had to speak out so, to prevent uh, the shooting from happening. In February, Boone Swallant says a Marymount High School classmate told him about a plan to conduct a mass shooting at the school. Like when I heard him talking, I knew that he was serious and I knew he was not joking. So I just kind of knew right away that I need to tell people ASAP. Because he spoke up, Marymount police officers launched an investigation. Those officers say Boom may have prevented a tragedy. They arrested another Marymount student, a 14-year-old boy, and charged him with conspiracy to commit aggravated murder. In response, Boom was invited to attend the State of the Union address with Congressman Greg Landsman. He flew to D.C. with his grandma Thursday morning. I mean, I'm nervous and excited. I don't know if I'm more nervous or He, he more is excited. going to go to a reception prior to okay. and then to the State of the Union, and it's him alone with Greg. Landsman says Boom is the perfect example of see something, say something. He hopes Boom's story inspires others. And hopefully have parents and young people, teachers all over the country uh, hear this story and say, I, I'm going to redouble my efforts uh, and, and, and talk to my kids uh, or students about how important it is to say something if you see something. Boom says he got that nickname when he was a kid. His family says it's stuck because of the motto he lived by. He told me that he wanted to make an impact on the world, and this has definitely made an impact. They now have this message to others who may find themselves in a similar situation. Just to speak out after hearing something, because you could prevent big things from happening like uh, school shootings and stuff. Sure, you could stop watching now, but let's be honest, you want to see more. So click some of those links, or better yet, go ahead and tap subscribe. That way you'll catch more content from Local 12.